I'm Dr. Erwin Redliner, a pediatrician and president and co-founder of the Children's Health Fund. In 1986, I had an opportunity to take singer-songwriter Paul Simon on a tour of New York's most notorious homeless shelters and welfare hotels, where thousands of homeless children lived in deplorable conditions. We saw for ourselves the enormous problems these children had in accessing health care. Because not getting health care on a regular and predictable basis can have devastating effects, we knew we had to do something. And that something turned out to be our first program in 1987, the New York Children's Health Project, and our very first doctor's office on wheels, a very unique mobile medical clinic that brought health care right to the doors of city shelters and welfare hotels. Over the years, we've seen that barriers to accessing health care exist in many rural and urban communities across the United States. A lack of pediatricians or medical specialists in certain communities, limited access to affordable transportation to even get to doctor's appointments, or lack of health insurance, and language and cultural disparities are a few of the key barriers that keep kids from health care. And for children who don't have regular access to health care, there could be lifelong consequences. A dental cavity that turns into a severe infection can actually be life-threatening. Misdiagnosed or undertreated asthma results in school absences, makes participation in physical activities difficult, and often results in avoidable hospitalizations. Children who don't get regular vision screening and can't see the blackboard in school participate less and may be mislabeled as learning disabled. Or the problem child whose simple behavioral troubles or emotional distress is not treated may develop chronic mental health problems. It's our fundamental belief that all kids can and should reach their full potential and become productive citizens, if only they're healthy, educated, and safe. But it all starts with good health. Today, we've grown from one mobile clinic in New York City to 50 mobile medical, dental, and mental health clinics. We have the largest network of its kind, serving homeless and low-income children and their families in the United States and bringing care directly to those who need it most. We provide referrals to needed specialists and aid to families in getting to their appointments with transportation resources. We've developed special initiatives that address topics like obesity and asthma and transportation, allowing us to accurately measure success and evaluate our work on an ongoing basis. With funding from a wide range of donors, Children's Health Fund will be able to sustain and increase the depth of services that we provide in rural and urban communities throughout the country and increase the number of children and families we serve. And finally, we aim to provide a powerful voice in Washington for those who do not have an opportunity to speak for themselves.